Sure. First thing I think it's important to pay attention to is culture is what happens when a group of people come together. In other words, you can't have a group of people, whether it's two people or whether it's 2000 people without a culture. People come together and they form a culture. That's what human beings do. Or as social science teaches us, culture is what makes us human. So that's the first thing. <laughs> you know, <laughs> culture happens as, as, soon as, uh, as soon as we come together. And then that happens and it happens for reasons that go way back, you know, millennia. But we come together, we form a culture, and then immediately we're asking four questions. Where are we going? And in the culture puzzle, we call that, that vision. Where are we going? How are we going to get there? And then the next question is, okay, we're together in this group. Well, what does it mean to be part of this group? Who's in this group? Who's out, outside this group? We call that interest in, in the sense that we all have an interest in belonging, in being part of a group. And then there's habit. And the way that comes into play is what do we do day in, day out that expresses our values? So we have a vision, we have a sense of where we're going, we know who's in our group, who's outside of our, our group. How do we reinforce that in, for example, how we have conversations, how we make decisions, how we make, uh, how we have meetings? So that's habit. And then the third question is, how might we do things a little bit better? How might we do things differently? In other words, how do we innovate? And we call that the, the force of innovation. So bottom line, we come together, we form a culture, and then it moves, if you like. We like to say culture moves. Culture comes first and it's always moving. It moves through these forces. And that's one of the really, to me, fascinating things about culture. It's always on the move. It defines us. It's dynamic. And one reason why it's dynamic is that the environment's dynamic. The market's dy dynamic. Customers are dy dynamic. Competitors are, are dynamic. So it's always changing. So, you know, wanted to go back to your original question. When folks feel like there's an issue in an organization, say it's, it's all about the culture. Well, of course, <laughs> because culture comes first. And it's natural for folks to feel that things could be different because culture is so dynamic. And we should always be asking, does it line up with what we need to do? Does it line up with what our people need? Does it line up with what our customers need, the market with what our competitors doing? Are we responding adequately? So it makes perfect sense that we're always asking about the culture. 